A new soccer match, written and illustrated by Noor Salah and Sara Hisham. Oh my god, the match against Real Madrid is after about two hours and a half. My clock is on obvious angle, and I'm still not ready for the match. I've got to practice a lot so we can win them, and I know we will. After winning them, we'll be holding the world's coolest irregular polygon trophy, and fans will be holding our team's new book that has parallel edits. They'll be waiting for us to sign them. What a cool thing. But mostly now, I've got to focus on the match more than the fans. God, time flies really quickly. It's time for the match. Wow, cool. Everyone is cheering for our team. And they are all holding rectangular shaped Barcelona flags. Look who's here. It's Real Madrid running with their acute angled legs. Well, I bet they don't have any chance to win us. They don't even have fans as much as we do. And look at those Pentagon flags. They really don't know how to pick a flag. The match has begun. Henry kicked the ball to Payal. Payal kicked the ball to Ito. Ito kicked the ball to me. And at last, I kicked the ball back to Henry and goal! The ball went right through the big squared goal. We formed a rumbus on the soccer field. Then Real Madrid got the ball out, so it was out on them. I had to throw the ball from the corner of the soccer field, which was a right angle. So the score was 1-0, and this is evidence that we are winning the world's biggest trophy. Then, the coach whistled and made his hand in a perpendicular line to begin the second half of the game. Then, we were going to start the second half. My team stood in a trapezoid, just like the plan was. I stood at the middle of the soccer field, where there is a straight line that is a straight angle, drawn in white. All Real Madrid players stood in a line. I guess they didn't have a plan. When the coach whistled, I straight away kicked the ball to Payal. Payal kicked it to Ito, and Ito kicked it to Abidal, who was running so fast and his legs were like obvious angles. Then again, we formed a complementary angle by passing the ball to each other. Whoa, I really study math a lot, but why can't I see any triangles? Oh, there is a scaling triangle in that man's hand. I guess it's a sign. Oh well, I turned around, and oh my god, Henry has twisted his leg. Now how is he going to play? Just look at him squeezing his leg into an acute anger. Poor Henry. They took him to the hospital in an ambulance that has four rectangular surfaces. But of course, we have to continue the game. I was worried about Henry, but I still tried to make my team win. I crossed my fingers to wish us and Henry luck. My fingers were vertical angles. I then stood at the right angle corner of the soccer field and kicked the ball to Payal. The clock is ticking. Its hands became an acute angle. We have only one minute left and I know we already won. Time is up. We won! 1-0 is the score. We won the world's coolest irregular polygon trophy. Fans were cheering happily and some of them were even holding flat square Barcelona flags. To go to Henry at the hospital. The road to the hospital is all a straight angle. We reached there with the coolest irregular trophy. Thanks God Henry was okay. We were so happy because we won. At the hospital, I saw that guy that was holding the scaling triangle. I asked him why was he here. He answered honestly that he followed us to come and see Henry too. He was a really nice person. Then, when everyone went home, we all changed our square Barcelona jerseys and shorts. Then, we went to keep our trophy in the big wooden cupboard, where it has parallel edges in the middle. I started to look at our new book, which had right angles from each side. After each game, I look out my right angle window and see shapes in the sky like a heart, which is an irregular polygon and lots of other lines. Then I lie down on my octagon carpet and think of lots of different things. Today was a big day in my life. We won Real Madrid and now I'm sitting in my chair thinking happily with the chair intersected and thinking so much about quadrilaterals and triangles, polygons, lines, angles and lots of other shapes. My favorite part of the day was when we formed a rhombus on the soccer field and the time when we scored in the big square goal. I really had fun today. The end. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed our project. In our project, we use an obtuse angle that measures more than 90 degrees and less than 180 degrees. 
and also we used parallel lines that are lines in the same plane that never intersect and irregular polygons that is a polygon in which most of the sides are not equal and all angles are not congruent we also use a parallelogram with four right angles acute angle that measures less than 90 degrees and a pentagon which is a quadrilateral with five sides and all angles are congruent a square with four equal sides and four congruent angles, parallelogram with four congruent sides, a right angle that measures exactly 90 degrees. Perpendicular lines intersect to form 90 degrees angles or right angles. A trapezoid that is a quadrilateral with exactly two parallel sides may have two right angles. A straight angle that measures exactly 180 degrees. A line is a straight path that extends without and in opposite directions. Complementary angles are two angles whose measure have a sum of 90 degrees. A scaling triangle that has no congruent sides. A line segment is made of two endpoints and all the points between the endpoints.